Hey guys, it is actually Saturday the 20th of April and I was I was going to try to get ready and, and um, shoot a couple of videos and, and all of that and I've had like, I'm so delayed, I've had like such a crazy day. So I, I had a couple of things I wanted to share with you and I know this is kind of a different video so it's not really a vlog but it is kind of more of a vloggy style because I'm going to show you a couple of little um, clips. So uh, a couple of things that... Um, that I got in the mail. And so I'm going to show you that in a few seconds. First of all, one one thing that I'm really super looking forward to is camping season. I think many of you know that I'm an avid camper. I love camping and we have a motorhome. So Jay and I brought the motorhome for its annual checkup to the motorhome, like, you know, doctor place or whatever, you know, where they check out motorhomes. And so it had all the safety things done and, and you know, the oil job, the lube, the whatever, um, got the you got the insurance activated again and went and got it registered and all that so that means we're ready to go camping so hampton beach where we love to go opens up traditionally the the last weekend of the month of april without reservations because it is like such a new hampshire has a very small coastline it's like 17 18 miles of coast throughout the state of new hampshire we only have one campground on the ocean. We have plenty of campgrounds on beaches and lakes all over the place, but on the ocean, an ocean beach, we only have one. Like, we are, like, so super excited about that. I don't get, a, like, a ton of PR. I mean, I do get Octoly, but I don't get a ton of PR, so I, I was just, like, really thrilled. So let me show you some of the things that I got. And then I, I would just kind of share with you some of these <laughs> things, you know, stuff that I have, PR packages, um, granted, you know, like when you, when you look at people, big YouTubers that get a ton of PR, it's like, oh my God, look at all that stuff. So some of this I bought, um, I had, I'm absolutely loving this, this I saw on Julie Mimosa's channel and she talked about this earbud case and how she uses it. I ended up ordering it. And I love it. Now, both Jay and I have Apple earpods. This works out perfect for me, and I also like that I can hang this off my bag. So I really love that. The other thing I, I got from her channel was she had put a link for these, and of course I do believe in supporting, so I did follow the links and buy it that way. But she had some driving gloves gloves that are sunblock, so I've been actually wearing those. They're in my car, and Jay has the car right now, so I can't share it with you. So that was something that I bought, and this kind of really lives in my purse. And, and many of you know that I did the Dr. Brandt neck sculpting treatment for eight weeks, and Dr. Brandt had reached out to me and asked me if I wanted to try some more of their products. And you know, of course I'm going to say yes. Yeah. So one of the things that was really intriguing to me was their 3D Lip Plump Fix. And I guess you have, you use in the morning is the blue and in the evening is the PM is the night. And this, I think you're going to be, the way I've done it anyways, I go right around my lips and concentrate on my lip wrinkles. So woohoo, wouldn't that be really cool? So this is some really awesome stuff. I haven't opened a lot of it up. I haven't tried the deep puffing gel. I'm finishing up a deep puffing gel that I've been using, so I really like that. And I haven't tried the retinol eye cream. This hyaluronic face cream, I'm definitely going to, to try. This, I definitely, definitely am looking forward to. And then they also sent me the next sculpting again. When I did the next sculpting treatment, and I've had the videos, I didn't see a big difference. But also the little chia stone or whatever it is had broken. And so I never... I probably didn't do it the right way. And then I also got some CBD cream. And this is Oh So Nice Soothing Cream. The woman that sent it to me is actually someone that I've met online years and years ago. We belong to a different group together. And so I'm gonna, I'll am gonna i link some of the information, but I will tell you that when Jay was out working in the yard and his, his back was really sore in this one area, I put this for his back, and he said it, actually felt good. So I have only tried this a couple of times. I'm going to continue to, to try it. I'll try it on his knees and stuff and I'll let you guys know. The other thing I got was this is MYK silk. Two pillowcases, silk pillowcases. I took a black and I chose a pink one and I chose these colors specifically because I want to probably the pink one at home and the black one I'm going to put on my pillows in the motorhome. This was sent to me in exchange for a review, I'm looking forward to it. I know I know that a lot of people really like the silk pillowcases for their hair, for their skin, and all that. So that'll be really cool. This 
I have not opened yet at all. This is actually hair extensions. I'm going to have to open them. <laughs> so I told you, see, all the stuff I got. And I think I've shared this on Instagram. They sent this little package um, with a sponge. And I have this. I have another sponge already that I like from Sigma Beauty that I've used. So this is really cool. I like that. I've got one open already. I'm not going to open this one. Their uh, brush cleaner solution is really super, super nice. And that's kind of the stuff that I got and bought. And there's my pocketbook. There's my... There's my uh, work backpack. Of course, what do I have in here? I have an umbrella, and I have this tube of the, the Australian gold. And then I have a whole bunch of other stuff in there. But, in but you know, it's kind of funny because some people really like to see PRs, and some people really like to see hauls, and some people like to see get ready with me, um, and some people like just chitty-chatty things. And um, so I'm always like, you know, I don't want to make it all the stuff that I got. But I'm also excited to share the stuff that I got with you guys so that you can see what I'm using, what works, and all that. And, you know, some of the products I get are things that I would want to buy but probably wouldn't buy because of pricing. And other products I get are things that I'm thrilled to have gotten but would never have gotten because I didn't wasn't aware of them. You know, like City Beauty, when they reached out to me, I, I had never really heard of City Beauty. And then when I said yes to them because I... I thought the product sounded pretty cool. Then I saw a lot of other people talking about City Beauty. YouTube has really, really opened up a whole world of different types of things for me. And so I think that's pretty cool. So I hope you don't mind me sharing. And I will apologize for my non-hairdo today. <laughs> I have no idea. So anyways, um, uh, you, by the time this is published, I probably will share with you a couple of Easter clips and then maybe a couple of things during the week. We have this big event at work this week coming up and uh, it's a, a premiere of the Avengers. We have a an advanced uh, seating. So I don't know if I'm going to share any of that. I don't know if I'm going to get that far, but that's what my week looks like. But today's Saturday and doing laundry. I'm going to shoot a video and I'm going to try to do some sort of a chitty chatty whatever this is, style video too. <laughs> Talk to you guys later. So I'm taking Fresh Boy out. Me? Fresh? Yeah. No way. Yeah, because everyone was like cracking up over what you were saying in the other video. Oh, well, okay. You're talking about sweet spots and you're talking about all sorts of stuff. So. Really? Me? Yeah. I wouldn't do something? No. Yep. Jaster. He's a monster. Just as a monster. Monster. So we're heading out. It is the night before Easter. And we are heading out to have dinner with friends. We're catching uh, dinner at the... Where are we going? Great American Tavern. Hampshire. Salisbury, Massachusetts. I've been there a couple of times and it's like monster portions. Oh, I forgot my wedding ring. <gasps> well, we'll pretend we're on a date and we're not married. Oh. Okay. Did you hear that, guys? We're going to pretend we're on a date and we're not married. Because you don't have yours on either. No, it doesn't fit. It's too too big. Oh, it's too big. We lost all that weight. We lost all that weight. So you should have it sized. Yeah. That's what we should do is go to the jeweler because she's got a bunch of my loose stones. So it's Easter Sunday. Last night we went out to dinner. I had two margaritas. It was wonderful. And I have mom. She had two margaritas. Listen, listen to that. And she there's did. dad. A drunken bum. She was. <laughs> They're calling me a drunken bum. Happy Easter, mom and dad. Happy Easter, honey. Happy, Happy Easter, Jacob. Joseph. Happy Easter, Oma <laughs> Happy Easter, everyone. So we're heading just to uh, my sister's house. I don't know. We'll just have sort of a feast. It's going to rain again. Better not rain. It is rain. <laughs> and I are off to a company event, and we're going to go see the Avengers. This is the premiere, the, the pre-premiere of the Avengers, and an event for our company that's a charity event. All the proceeds are going to Variety Cares, so, you know, for the charities that we support in our communities. And it's going to be, I think it's going to be fun, honey. Yeah. Are you going to pick out and eat pizza? Yeah. Pizza! Pizza! So I think it's where it's going to be at Chunky's, right? Yep. They get big, big seats. <laughs> Probably need it after we eat the pizza. <laughs> so that's what we're going to do. Later, guys.
Hey guys, Jay and I went to the movies last night and we actually enjoyed the Avengers. Now I had no clue what to expect, I really didn't because I hadn't, I don't know, hadn't followed it, I hadn't watched any of the previous movies that I could recall, but it was really a good show. We, it was over, just about three hours long and um, we didn't get home till like almost quarter of 11, so I'm like a little, really, really tired today. But today is Friday the 26th. We were supposed to go in the beach, but it's pouring out. We made the decision yesterday when we listened to the weather forecast that it was going to rain all weekend to not go camping. So I'm really bummed. But I also wasn't prepared. I didn't have any time to stock the motorhome. So it's, it's probably for the best. It's probably for the best. And maybe next weekend will be a better weekend and we can try to get in at that point in time. But this will be the first opening weekend in Hampton that we've missed in a long, long time. So, Isn't this beautiful? <laughs> can you imagine this arriving on your doorstep on Mother's Day? So this is a Mother's Day special from Balanzo Handbags. And this is a subscription handbag service. And I know you've seen some of my videos about this before because I've shown certain bags that they've sent me and fanny packs and all sorts of travel bags. And I have a perfect one for my computer. And so this one arrived this week just in time for Mother's Day. And so what this is, can this is like, I think it's absolutely perfect and you still have time to do it. So I'm going to do the link below where you can actually get the Mother's Day special. You can also order this and, and I think it's like 43 something a month if you do a three or a six or a 12 month subscription. It is just really, I mean to me, if you like bags, if you like these types of you know, gift bags, or I should say cosmetic bags, and you like things like this, this is perfect. So this actually arrived with this really pretty little note for Mother's Day. Mother's Day card, a flower for my hair. really like that. That's really cool. And oh my gosh, let me show you. Right away, the first thing that pops out is this absolutely, absolutely adorable, adorable cosmetic bag. And there's cosmetics inside it. Body butter. Oh my gosh. A little Mara cream. This is absolutely, this is really adorable. And just what I needed, I needed a cosmetic bag. So let me show you what, I feel like a kid in a candy store. Silicone socks. Last month, I got hand gloves. I think I probably have showed you those hand gloves a couple of times, but I absolutely love those hand gloves. They are, like, amazing. So, silicone socks to keep my feces moist. Oh, my gosh, and there's more. This is the kind of stuff that your mother or someone you, you really, really want to treat to a Mother's Day bag like this would get. A gorgeous, gorgeous scarf. Can you see the color theme? Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah, and a bag. Wow, this is incredible. And there's more. There's a handbag. Holy mackerel. Now this is a color that I've never had in the shoulder straps. I've never had this in a handbag before, this color. But if you are the type of person that likes to mix up your look, I mean, how perfect is that? There's a couple of notes in here. Surprise! And more surprises. Wow. This is really awesome. On signing up, you can receive a special surprise in styling each month. To kick off your membership, we have chosen our Beatrice Top Handle, especially for you. It is constructed from Petra Certified Vegan Leather. It has a retail value of $139. Beatrice is a brand is brand new for the spring and not yet available for purchase online. It is member exclusive and comes in baby pink, army green, a brown, and of course black. And wow, this is really nice. Really, really nice. Actually has a lot of room in here. This is pretty cool. There's jewelry every month. 
there's jewelry that is sent. Oh my gosh, this is absolutely adorable. It's a little bracelet. It has mom on it. And a necklace. I have to take this out and, yeah, a necklace. This is really adorable. I'm gonna have to open this up. I'm just like in love with this little pink little makeup bag. This is so cute. But the whole the whole thing about a subscription, you know, you can get Boxy Charm, you can get Ipsy, you can get all sorts of monthly boxes with makeup and cosmetics. And then there's even some with clothes that I've seen that people really like, you know, Fab Fit Fun, all that kind of stuff. But I think this is just really an awesome thing because this gives you the ability, in my opinion, to really switch up your look. And maybe, I don't think I would have bought myself this. And I've never owned anything in this color. And I think it's probably coming across more orange. It's actually more of a, a brown, a light, light brown. So I think that's pretty cool. I want to thank Balonzo for sending this to me. Again, this is a subscription service and I will link all the information to you guys below. But what a treat to come home for something like this because my day didn't start that well this morning. I When I do my eyes, and I do my eyebrows. I have been using for a long, long time the Lancome Sorcil Styler. So after I put my eyebrow pencil on, I take the styler. This is a Lancome. I really like this a lot. And I put it over my brows. And, and I'm really good because I've used it for so long. I'm really good. I just sometimes I don't have to pay much attention. I just know exactly how to put it. It kind of puts my brows in place. <laughs> So this morning, because I don't bring, I don't wear my glasses when I'm doing my eyes, right? So this morning I'm in the bathroom and I did my brows and I was like, wow, they're looking really good. And then I went and I grabbed my Sorcil Lancome stylist and um, I opened it up and I didn't even look. I didn't even notice that it was a little bit shorter. I didn't notice anything, but then I went like this and then I went boom. And as soon as I did one eye, I could see Groucho marks all over the place. What I did is I grabbed the little sample of my It Cosmetics Superhero Mascara instead of the Lancome. I was like, oh my gosh. And I'm running late, you know. I'm like, this is not what I need to stop my day. So my day was just, and then it just got worse from there. Because I had to take everything off, start all over again. It just got worse from there. And then when I got home. I saw this treat and I was like, yes, ended up being a great day. So, yeah, I really like it. Let me know what you think. Guys, it is Saturday. And most of you know, if you've been following along on, say, Instagram, and I know all of you are on Instagram, but if you're on Instagram, and I'm not telling you to go over to Instagram, but if you are on Instagram, make sure you follow me. It's Monica with a K M C G. But, anyways, on my Insta stories, you know, we talked about going camping, and I talked about going camping in this in this video as well. Well, the weather turned sour, and we made the decision yesterday to not go camping because of the weather. And um, I mean, look at it now outside my bathroom window. It's nice and clear right now, but it was pouring like you wouldn't believe at all all day yesterday all day last night so I'm glad we didn't go because we're also having some deck work done to the front of our house and the because of the weather the contractor's been super super delayed so I know this is getting like wicked long but before I end it there's a couple of things I wanted to mention on Instagram and I do insta stories like I would say most every single morning I do insta stories on Instagram I really like doing Insta stories because they are 15 second clips and you can do little little spurts of them. Like I might start out in the morning with a minute clip and put it up there and they only last for like 24 hours. But I mean, I do other things on Instagram as well, but those little clips are a lot of fun. But anyway, so since the beginning of March, when I got my hands on the CYO, the CYO foundation, can you see the numbers on there? I have 104, 106, and 107, right? I got this at the beginning of March. What I ended up doing, this is like, this is the CYO Long Lasting Foundation Life Proof. Now, CYO has a couple of different other foundations that I've seen some other content creators talk about, but there is, this is a different CYO foundation. Same company, just different 
blend or whatever. I think there's a couple of other people that have used this that really, really likes this particular blend. One is Nisha, Sugar Puff and Fluff. I think Susan Little Poet likes this blend a lot. And I'm not too sure who else, but I know that I've, I've seen people talk about this blend and then also talk about the other blend um, that CYO has. So I could only get this on Walgreens. And what I had to do is I had to kind of guess on the colors, which I've talked about in previous videos. So I don't want to bore you with all the gory details. So I went on the Walgreens website and then, you know, I went to the Boots because this is where you can get this is on the Boots website, the UK and the Boots website. And I color matched. And because I was so unsure, I took these three. So since March, when we came back from Vegas, I've been pretty well using this a couple of times a week, but the last three weeks or so, I've been almost using it every other day, if not every day. And what I do is I take all three of these, I put them in my hands, I blend them together in my hands. I use my, I use the, the back of my hand as a palette. I blend it together and then I will pat it on and I take my, my whatever sponge I'm using and I just tap it in with a dampened sponge. Tap, tap, tap. I don't swish it around. I know I've mentioned that before. So anyways, long story short, um, because when I first talked about these, I just got it. I really hadn't given it any, any staying power. I will tell you, if I can get my hands on this again, my understanding is Walgreens took it off their website. I'll have to go back on the website to see if it's back available. But at one point, Walgreens took it off and it was no longer available on their website, of course. But if I can get my hands on this again, this particular formula, not the CYO foundation in the tube or the other one, but this one, the long lasting foundation life proof, I'm going to buy it because you can build this up to a full coverage. No kidding, Jose, truly, truly a full coverage. So what I do is because I have like veins on my nose that I really try to cover up a lot. I take, I take the Boeing, which is the Benefit Concealer. Now there's two different tones. Let me see if I have it here. I do. I do have it here. I've got three of them here, actually. I, and I have a couple in my bag. But there is two different types. The, the Boeing has an Industrial Strength Concealer, and then it has Regular Concealer. Don't confuse them. The regular concealer is a really nice concealer. It's a brightener and all that stuff. But the industrial strength, I use three, I use two, and I use one under my eyes when I use it. The industrial strength concealer is the one that I use, the one that I talk about. Very different than the regular Boeing Benefit uh, concealer, Boeing. So what I do in the morning is I take that industrial strength and I put it on my, my veins. And then I do the mixture of the three colors and blend them in really good. And then I put that on my face and I build it up. And I'm telling you, I don't know whether it's the combination of the three, but every time I wear this foundation, I get people on my Insta stories that send me direct messages and they say, I don't know what foundation you're wearing, but it's perfect for your skin. I don't know what color you, you've got on, but your skin looks really, really good. And I don't get those compliments when I'm wearing my Estee Lauder. I don't get those compliments when I'm wearing my, my regular um, number seven, Lift and Luminate that I love. But when I wear the CYO, I think it's the lighter shade that are, that's making people comment. I've never had so many comments on a darn foundation in my life. Not only on my Insta stories, but in my real life, in my job, people go, oh, you know, your skin looks really good or something like that. So it's like really amazing the amount of comments that I get. So I'm just playing with my hair. I'm just playing with my hair. But anyways, I just wanted to tell you this because I, I kept meaning to go back and, you know, update you on this, how this foundation is working and, the, and all of that. And I just keep forgetting. But I think it's like if you can, when I bought mine, I think you paid full price for one, got the other half off and or something like that or free. Buy two, get one free, something like that. Walgreens had a really good sale, but they're like five bucks each. Cheap. And if you ship, like say if you buy it and you have it shipped to your local Walgreens and pick it up there, you save on shipping. So I have Walgreens all around me. So that's what I did. I, I bought the three. I think I paid for two, got one free, and had it shipped to my local Walgreens so I didn't have to pay any shipping. And um, 
yeah for my I think this this if I can only find the perfect color and if if Walgreens has it back on their website this is going to be my drugstore foundation of choice because I love I love how we can build it up. I just really do. I love how we, how we can build it up, build it up, and I like the skin tone that I'm getting as well. So, yeah. What do you think? Do you like this color on me? So, anyways, I'm gonna end end this video. I know it's been a lot about a lot of different things from PR, from skincare, from camping, from Easter, from family, you know, from the Avengers. Oh my God, that movie rocked. Um, it's just been sort of a mishmash of a little bit of everything and I I truly appreciate all of you watching it and my coming to the premieres. I think the premieres are a lot of fun because as this video is playing, you guys are in the chat room talking up a storm. I'm in the chat room with you. We're talking back and forth. We're having a blast. And then most of you come back and you watch the video afterwards because you might be so busy chatting in the chat that you're kind of not paying attention to the video. But the video is getting playtime by YouTube, so it's really good. And of course, premiering a video is something that YouTube likes, so it kind of does highlight it a little bit, you know, shows it in the stream and all that. And, and that's a good thing. So YouTube is just going into some massive changes. They're still going through this whole phase of, you know, people are being unsubscribed to channels and stuff like that. So just make sure you still subscribe to me. Make sure you thumbs up the video. And I know I feel like a broken record. If you're not subscribed, but you're watching my video, please consider subscribing. I would truly, truly appreciate it very much. And thank you all so much for being here. I know you have better things to do with your time than to spend what is it, 25 minutes, 30 minutes with me? I don't know. But I truly appreciate every single one of you. Bye, guys.